Hey folks, I wanted to give you a little uh, more in-depth review of a new bridge I got uh, a couple weeks back. This is the Camo Frog Bridge by Mr. Virgil Lawson. If you take a look at it, he's got two different types of woods laminated together. So it's a very unique looking bridge. Uh, one of the best looking ones on the market, I think. Uh, and also it's uh, fully compensated. So if you take a look at that, the second string and the fourth string are a little closer to the neck, while the third string is a little closer to the tailpiece. So the theory behind that is uh, it keeps your banjo in tune better as you play up the neck. So what I want to do for you today is to play, uh, uh, play something in G and then play a little something up the neck. And the other thing I wanted to do is to, to capo it up into B for you and let you hear, uh, hear what it sounds like. I like it. A, uh, a lot better than some of the other bridges, especially when you capo. Some of those uh, other bridges start to sound thin or um, kind of tinny as you go up the neck. But I think this one it's got, is pretty even all the way up and down the neck. And whatever key you want to play in, it still sounds rich and full. Uh, somebody described it as warm sounding, and I would I tend to agree with that. Uh, but here's a little something for you. Here's a little bit up the neck, a little two finger back up. And let me put the capo on real quick and play a little something in B. So all I really have to do is spike the fifth string. And all the rest of them should still be in tune. Pretty good. All right, here we go. the um, Camo Frog Bridge. Take a look at that one more time and if you're interested contact Mr. Lawson and I'm sure he will be glad to fix you right up.